We must remember this. Turkey has ratified the Paris Agreement. We congratulate the, the Republic of Turkey for doing this. It will open the door for this very important G20 country to undertake a wide range of activities to address climate mitigation and climate adaptation. So now Turkey is beginning to implement this green development revolution and we know that it will be of great benefit not only to Turkey but of course the region and globally as well. Now we see people moving because of climatic emergencies and we expect that in the next couple of decades a quarter of a billion people will probably be moving between and within countries to try and find a better livelihoods, better opportunities for their children. So I think what some call climate democ di uh, diplomacy will certainly become a much more important topic in the years to come. I think there are two issues that confront Turkey. One is more internal and that is independence of, on, uh, the dependence on fossil fuels and particularly co uh, charcoal, coal. I think that needs to change. But Turkey also sits in a very interesting neighborhood with many uh, neighboring countries and is uh, in a sense a hub for many migration flows. It is very likely that Turkey will be impacted by those migration flows in the years and decades to come.